Um, <laughs> like he wouldn't just, would just totally wouldn't get it. But brilliant. Ladies and gentlemen, coming up next, uh, another comedian, Mr. Merrill Davis. Come on, Merrill. Missy! <laughs> female, Meryl, to give us I thought it was a different one. I, uh, I made a special change just for tonight. It's a special night, and you have to make a special change. I love your outfit. I, 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 love, I love yours. Thank you. Well, we'll change, we'll swap, swap later. Okay, hi, everybody. Shorten that. Uh, <clears throat> I'm hearing that too. Is anyone else hearing it? No. Good to know. Great. Excellent. I'll enjoy it while you don't. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> Dear Mr. President, uh, I won't be ignored, George. I can't believe you didn't text me after our date. <laughs> I'm sorry I brought up the whole... Barack is such a smart man with class and all subject. But you said you were open-minded. So, uh, you know. Um, but you really inhaled that whole eight ball, for God's sakes. So, uh, <laughs> look, the reason I'm writing this letter is because you won't return any of my texts or calls or emails or messenger pigeons. And, um, so here it is. I'm preggers. <laughs> and uh, it's a problem because I I don't have health insurance. Um, I've also circled uh, the White House like one time, <laughs> and security detained me and threatened to send me to Guantanamo, which sounded really exotic at first, but then I thought, you know. Probably should get back home. So, um, so anyway, I figured I'd, I'd better tell you this via U.S. mail. So I'm offering you a deal. If uh, if I keep this baby <laughs> thing, uh, I'll keep it on the DL, and uh, that's not driver's license. Um, <laughs> and since I'm carrying your child, uh, maybe you can help out, help a sister out <laughs> with uh, health insurance, a gas card, and. Uh, Perhaps an education at Yale. <laughs> I was thinking we need to make some decisions on how we're going to raise him. Um, logistically, it's going to be tough because you live in the White House and I live in Little Armenia. <laughs> so, there's that. 